SATpractice.org is an online support system for students who have just completed the PSAT or intend to take the SAT. So it is a free online platform commonly known to Khan Academy. And so it's an extension of Khan Academy that kids have access to free personalized practice. They get that tailored support. So when we say a student is linked to satpractice.org, we say that their PSAT scores have become one with satpractice.org, which allows them to access questions, videos, tutorials, diagnostic tests that are linked to their current level as determined by the PSAT. A student might take a diagnostic test and it'll determine where they're at and it'll give them further questions to help develop their skills with the intent of improving their scores on the next PSAT or SAT. So our eighth graders are taking the PSAT 8-9 in order to create a baseline. In order to see how they've grown from year to year, we need to know where they started. So in eighth grade, we're seeing where are you at? Where are you starting? Then they go into ninth grade, and at that point, we're really starting to look at not just how have you grown, but where should you be stretching yourself? This helps inform the students on where they can start taking some of those honors level courses or AP, looking at how am I going to grow with my own strengths. 10th grade, you're again trying to find your strengths, finding those advanced courses. You're also starting to get ready for 11th grade, when in 11th grade, when you sit and take that test, that's how you qualify for national merit scholarship, which is a um, umbrella scholarship that opens a lot of doors for a lot of students. It also, at that point, can start serving as a concordance score if you need a score to make up for your FSA. In 11th grade, we are now having students sit for their first paid full-length SAT during the school day, and the district is covering the cost of that. So students are able to take their first college entrance exam for free in a school setting where they're comfortable. Our, our seniors who have not met their concordance scores are also able to join in that day. So there's no Saturday necessary for your students to get started. So satpractice.org is completely free, personalized practice. There is no fee associated with it, which is why this is so exciting. Parents have been paying for SAT prep for a really long time, and this is one way for all kids to have access to vetted information. Students should be using satpractice.org at least 30 minutes a week, and this is really for high school students to be using 30 minutes a week. So another advantage to getting on to satpractice.org is when a student is practicing for the SAT, they're also really practicing for their day-to-day -day classroom instruction because of the alignment of standards and it's helping potentially improve their FSA scores because of the direct alignment between PSAT and our Florida standards. On the district website, if parents have any questions, there are some frequently asked questions on the advanced studies page that tell you all about the suite of assessments and then answer some of those questions that you may have.